In this question, we are given let f of x is equals to x square minus 4x minus 3, where x is greater than 2, and let g be the inverse of f. g is the inverse of f. Then we have to find the value for g of x when f of x is equals to 2. Now see, g is the inverse of f. So we have g into f, this will be equals to identity, that is 1. So we have g into f of x is equals to 1. Now differentiate this using product rule, we will get g dash into f of x plus g into f dash of x, this will be equals to c. Now see we are given that f of x is equals to 2, f of x is equals to 2. So we will solve this to find the value for x, see f of x is x square minus 4x minus 3, this is equals to 2, so this implies that x square minus 4x minus 5 is equals to 0. Now we will factor this, so see we will get, we will get x square minus 5x plus x minus, sorry minus, this is minus of minus 5 is equals to 0. So from here see factors will be x minus 5 and x plus 1, this is equals to 0. So we get x is equals to 5 and x is equals to minus 1. But see we are given that f of x is valid when x is greater than 2. So, x is equals to minus 1, this will not be the condition, so we get x is equals to 5, we have x as 5, substitute x as 5 in the equation, see equation 1, so we will get, see equation 1, we will get g dash of 5 into f of 5 plus g of 5 into f dash of 5 is equals to 0. Now, first we will find the value for f dash of 5, so f of x. This is given as x square, f of x is x square minus 4x minus 3, minus 4x minus 3. So, f dash of x, this will be equals to 2x minus of 4. So, f dash of 5, this will be equals to 10 minus 4, that is 6. f dash 5, this value is 6. Now, we will find the value for g of 5. So, we are given f into g, this is equals to 1. So, f into g of 5, this will also be equals to 1. So, from here we get g of 5 is equals to 1 by f of 5 and f of 5, this is 2. So, we get this is 1 by 2. Substitute these values in this equation, in this given equation. So, see we will get, we get g dash of 5 into f of 5 is 2 plus g of 5 is 1 by 2 into f dash 5 f dash 5 we have calculated as 6, so 6 this is equals to 0, so from here g dash of 5, see this will be equals to 2 g dash of 5, this is equals to minus of 3 and this implies that g dash of 5, this is equals to minus 3 by 2, so this is the required answer of this question.